everybody welcome back to my channel and today I'm gonna to be talking about nice guy or the innocent man smart and promising medical student Tang Maru is deeply in love with his slightly older neighbor Han Jiehi who is a reporter when her situation takes the turn for the worst and Jehi becomes desperate to escape poverty she meets a rich man who changes everything and introduces her to a life of comfort so she turns her back on Maru choosing money over love the brutal betrayal leaves Maru fractured and not only just angry but a completely changed man. A few years later, Maru is now 30 years old, a bartender and a gigolo. No longer a nice guy. He then meets Ungi, Ungi, a young Chebol heiress who's being groomed to take over her father's business. Ungi is cold and calculating and raised by her father to never show emotion to anyone. Maru decides to take revenge on his ex, Jehi, and bring her down from her position after his sister is rushed to the hospital because of Jehi. Maru, though initially had no plans as such, uses Ungi to take revenge on Jehi. Just when Maru is beginning to fall in love with Ungi, she finds out the real reason why he approached her and they break up. But a car accident causes Ungi, Ungi to lose her memory and she enters Maru's life again okay so i finished this drama by doing an all-nighter i don't really know how to express my feelings about this drama but what i can say is that nice guy or the innocent man is no ordinary drama what i liked about this drama was that the leading characters are both smart and savage i'm not a huge fan of dramas that have 20 episodes but thankfully this drama moved along nicely song joon gi played his role exceptionally well when he was nice, he made us all swoon, but when he was nasty, he was a right asshole. I actually quite liked Park Seon's character, um, even though we're not really meant to. I disliked Moon Che Won's character. In some parts, I found her to be a little bit selfish and cruel, but you do also pity and relate to her. I didn't cry at all during this drama, which is kind of shocking considering how much tears were shed he'd be expected to cry at least once in this but i had nothing nada i much prefer dramas that make me laugh the music in this was different from others the music used was quite strange and chilling and it kind of gave me an inkling of what was going to happen next which is no fun the plot of nice guy has been done before but thankfully the writers created twists that left an impression and added mature content to make it just a little different. It had all the elements to create a good melodrama, which includes betrayal, love, murder, attempted murder, and amnesia. What I disliked about this drama is the second half. It did seem to drag a little bit. I mean, did this drama really need 20 episodes? No, personally. Jaehee's final actions were way out of character i didn't find her tears convincing at all and i didn't feel an ounce of sympathy towards her throughout this drama she was a crazy person a total whack job so because of all those reasons i gave this drama three stars i won't be watching this again i like to laugh that's it for this video thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next video bye